Hello everyone. In this video, I'm going to cover how to create an access token for Azure bot services. Now, before I do that, first the bot itself has to be hosted somewhere. Bot runs as a website, so I'm going to host it in one of my Azure websites uh, over here. So if you see over here, I have got a bot hosted called Agile Money Next Bot. If I click on it, so once it is deployed, I have to copy this URL, then go to all resources and register the bot itself. I'm going to say add under AI and cognitive services, click on see all. Scroll down. So there is something called as bot channel registration. This is the new way of registering a bot in Azure. Click on create. Give it a name. Now, once you give it a unique name, choose your subscription, choose your resource group where you want it to be created. So I'm going to create it under a test group. Choose a location where you want it to be deployed, your pricing structure. I'm going to select the free one. Now in the messaging endpoint, this is where you will put your bot URL. So you will put the base URL and typically all bots have a URL called API slash messages. You can decide whether you want to keep the insights on or off. And then you can either select auto create app ID and password, or you can, you can manually create it as well. So you, you have an option of uh, either creating it manually or doing it automatically. I'm going to select auto create, click create. So it tells me that the deployment of this thing is in progress. It takes few seconds. I'll go ahead and click on go to resource. Settings. Under settings, click on manage. You need the client ID and client secret. So click on manage. It takes you to the app registration portal from Azure. Here is your bot. Here is your client ID. So let's go ahead and copy it somewhere. And we will generate a new password. Now always copy this because this is shown one time. Once we click OK, this will not be visible again. You have to create a new one. You can create as many new ones as you want though. Now once I have all this, let's uh, you can you can do other things like you can give permissions to your graph URLs, but we'll just go with default. We go back to Agile Point Portal. In the Manage Center, we are going to create a new global access token. We'll select Azure Bot Services. Give the API key, which I have in my Notepad. password click on test connection the connection is successful and then click on done so that's how you create a azure bot services access token which you can use in the bot related workflow activities thanks a lot for your time